Okay, I want everyone to take out a piece of paper. And on that piece of paper, I want you to draw a circle, a circle, and a triangle. <clears throat> we learned these shapes before, right? A circle is round, and a triangle is has three points, okay? One, two, three. So everyone just draw a circle and a triangle. Now hold up your drawing for me to see, and let me choose a few. Okay. This is Susan's picture, okay? A circle and a triangle. This is Chong's picture. A very small circle and a triangle. And this is Lily's picture. A circle that's on top and a triangle, uh, sorry, a triangle on top and a circle below. All three pictures are different, wouldn't you say? So different. Okay, now take out another piece of paper. And this time, I want you to draw a circle in a triangle. Okay? A circle in, inside the triangle. That's right. Mm -hmm. Okay, everyone hold up your paper for me to see. All right, can I borrow yours for a bit? Okay, this is Ahmad's drawing, and this is what all of you draw. Uh, sorry, all of you drew. A circle in a triangle. So you see, when I specified, when I said clearly that I wanted the circle to be inside the triangle, all of you gave me the same picture. That is why it is important to tell you where I want the circle and the triangle, right? So today, we are going to learn about prepositions. In, the one I used just now, is a preposition. A preposition is a word that shows where something is or where it is going, okay? The direction or the place that something is. Okay, and um, we're going to watch a video that has three prepositions inside it and we are also going to play charades later. I know you like to play charades. And by the end of this lesson, you will know how to use prepositions. And yeah, let's move on to the video then. Okay, now can anyone tell me what were the three prepositions that we heard in the song? In front of, good. How do you spell front? F R O N T. Very good. In front of. What was the second preposition? Behind. B E H I N D behind. What does it mean? It means to be behind. Okay, what was the action in the song? This was in front of. This was behind. That's right. What was the third one? B between. All right, good. Does anyone know how to spell that? That's a quite. That's quite a long word. B E T W right E E N between it means to be between something in the middle of just say um okay look at Ahmad Ali and Lily Ali is between Ahmad and Lily okay all right we are going to learn more prepositions we you already know this one in it means inside okay. And here's another one. On. Okay. Your books are on the table. That means they are on top of the table. That's right. 
so above. Or if I if I stand on this chair, then I am on the chair. Okay. So it means let me draw a little stick figure here. On a I don't know on a chair. I'm just gonna draw this box. This is a box. This is a box. This is a chair. And the person is on the chair. Uh, okay, in, on, under. I wanted to teach under as well. Mm. Under. Can anyone guess what this is? Yeah, it means underneath. Okay, so where is the, if I draw a person under a chair, where is the chair? The chair is up here, and the person is down here, okay, under.